Hey Karen and Ken, welcome and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, take one quick second, go down below, hit that subscribe button and click that bell button so you never miss the next time I upload. And if you've seen by the title, you know what we're doing today. Today we're trying out the new Shea Moisture Defining Styling Gel. And I'm super excited about it. So that's what we're doing today. Even if you want to see me try this out on my hair, keep on watching. My hair is already washed and deep conditioned. I uh, shampooed with the Camille Rose Sweet Ginger Cleansing Rinse. I have tried this on my channel, slash used this on my channel multiple times. Um, and then also deep conditioned with the Mayel Babasu and Mint Deep Conditioner. It's a protein moisture balance type deep conditioner. And I don't remember last time I did like a protein treatment type deal. So that's what I wanted to use. I do like the clear rinse, but it's it's light, so it's not like a protein treatment, you know. But still, and so now it's time to do the wash and go. Um, if you know Shed Moisture, this is the coconut and hibiscus line, and you know that was like the main line when everybody started going natural. Like everybody was going after the Curl and Shine shampoo. I think that's what it was called. Yeah. Everybody was going after that line. That's all you seen on the YouTube videos. They was like, you gotta try this, you gotta do this, and then you gotta uh, have the curly hands and smoothie. Like that's that was the talk. Like everybody talked about that. So when they came out with this gel, at first I seen another creator, you know, use it, and I was like, excuse me, ma'am, where did you get that? Cause I haven't seen that. I thought, you know, she was lying or something. But you know she had it, so I was like, okay, I go along with what you're talking about. But then I finally synced it in my Walmart, and I was like, okay, okay. So what I'm doing today is I'm going to use the curl enhancing smoothie with the gel, so I can see what's gonna happen. I, I thought it should be a good idea to you know just mix the two together since they're from the same line. You would probably get you know good results. So that's what I'm gonna do. So, I already, you know, sectioned my hair into four sections. So, all I need to do now is wet my hair because it has been a minute since I washed out my deep conditioner. And I want, you know, it to actually want to go onto my hair. Um, also, the Curly Hansen Smoothie is really, really thick. And I don't want to use a lot of it because I don't want it to take forever to dry. So, I'm going to use less than what I normally use. If you know me, you know I'm pretty heavy-handed. With product but I'm trying to use less with this one okay so and I haven't detangled my hair yet so I guess I'm gonna detangle with the curling Hansen smoothie and if you don't know about the curling Hansen smoothie this is how thick it is it's like very 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 thick and that's how much I plan to use I don't want to use a lot and the smell oh my god smells so good it brings back memories from when I was transitioning because I used to use this on all of my like roller sets and stuff and bantu knots when I was transitioning because you know the girlie was like this what you use this what you use so I was like okay that's what I'm gonna use oh and it got a lot of slip to say I haven't deep condition I mean haven't detangled this whole wash day and the brush is going straight through. So, now, let's get on to the gel. Um, like I mentioned before, it is from the Coconut and Hibiscus line, but they added flaxseed into it. It's the defining styling gel with silk protein and neem oil to define and shine thick curly hair it says this non-alcohol based formula infused with silk protein neem oil and natural flexi oil provides long lasting hold and shine without drying out your hair this styling gel also defines and smooths the hair while taming frizz and flyaways for a healthy look and feel you'll sure to love i say it's perfect for achieving a twist out braid out and or wash and go okay it's formulated without parabens phthalates mineral oil animal testing and petroleum so 
it smells just like the um curling Hansen smoothie which is good because the curling Hansen smoothie smells great um this is the consistency it's it's like a jelly but also like it's like a cross between a gel and a jelly because it's thick but it's also like sort of kind of runny so let's just see what happens when I apply this to my hair I was very excited for this video honestly because I don't think Shea Moisture ever came out with a gel before like they came out with a um jelly and I never tried the jelly but when I came out with the gel, I was like, I gotta try it. It's a, the other one was the gel souffle. I think that's what it was called. But, okay. They said my hair needs to be a little wet. So I sprayed more water. And I'm gonna start with about this much. I'm gonna just continue because right now it's looking like it's, it's a good gel. This is what the look what it's looking like I got a whole lot of curl definition but I do want to add one thing when you use this gel make sure your hair is I don't want to say soaking wet but make sure your hair is wet because if if not okay I like my own um, curls to be clumped but not too clumped it had my curls so clumped it just looked like one big piece of hair like I don't know how to explain it, but it it didn't have them 
it had it too comped. I like my hair to, you know, be defined, but not too, you know? Like, I wanna see, like, certain curls, not like all this whole section clumped together. So I had to use a lot of water, and I also didn't use warm water, I just used the spray bottle that was next to me. But next time I use this, I will use you know warm water so it'll be a whole lot easier on myself because using cold water with low porosity hair i knew that wasn't gonna work in the beginning but i still did but here we are it's looking pretty good the curl definition is there this is one of the heaviest gels i have ever used in my life but i feel like it, since i used the curling hansen smoothie with this my hair is going to be very very moisturized because the curly hair smoothie is very moisturizing so we might have something good so i'm going to hey curly can uh i was supposed to come back as soon as my hair dried but it is day four so my hair has been dry for a while now i just forgot to come back so yeah but this is what my hair is looking like it was very very defined on the first day i even uploaded a picture on instagram because it looks so good uh you know put the picture over here so you can see but yeah my hair looked really really nicely and i like the gel so uh my final thoughts are if you are a fan of shea moisture and the coconut and hibiscus line i would go and try it out because it's a really nice gel and i also feel like in my opinion i feel like it's like thicker than most gels that i have tried on my channel because like it's really really thick um but because it was so thick you know it could hold the curl better in my opinion so i liked it and the smell you know like i said it smells like the rest of the line and it was only i think like eight dollars so it's a nice price range so if you want to try it you can and i think a little goes a long way but i'm slightly heavy-handed so i used a lot but not a lot like i still have a lot left in the package so i'm good i feel like it can last me at least Probably about five or six if I'm pushing it, wash and goes, twist offs, whatever. That's it for this video. But before you go, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and click that little bell button so you never miss the next time I upload. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.